Well, it's been an issue for some time, the speed limit and why it hasn't changed from 55 to 65 miles an hour on highways here in the UP. For your Facebook story today, TV6's Jennifer Perez looked into how this, uh, this issue, and she joins us now with more. Jennifer? Steve, it's a lot more complicated to change a speed limit than one might think. Limits are set based on what officials decide is the safest for drivers. A new speed survey might change the limit of 55 to 65 on two lane highways. Speed limits were originally reduced by the federal government to 55 miles per hour on highways in the 80s to save gas. The new study will be conducted in Gulver. And that's our number one goal in establishing speed limits is to get a uniform flow of traffic so traffic can travel unobstructed, uh, therefore creating a safer environment. For the change to happen, there needs to be a legislative approval. Currently, the only area in the UP with a 65 limit is between Gladstone and Rapid River. When studies are conducted, they take the driving speed of the 85 percentile of drivers. So this research determines the safest driving limit for a given area. Joseph Pearson writes, 55 is a good speed for the UP. I've seen too many accidents caused by someone not being able to stop in time. Officials say the tricky part to increasing the limit for a two-way highway is determining if it's safe enough. The more number of shoulders, intersections, and driveways that are off the road, the greater the risk for possible crashes. We're hoping to look at that and try to figure out if indeed is there a basis to change the motor vehicle code maximum speed limit on non-freeway. The new study will be conducted next month. If the research shows the limit should be increased, legislatures will make the final decision.